hello friends welcome back to my youtube channel the topic that i am going to discuss today is broad classification of enzymes that are used in gene cloning in this video i am going to discuss two aspects namely first a short introduction to enzymes that are used in gene cloning that is why enzymes are important in gene cloning and second its broad classification so without a further delay let us go into the details of enzymes that are used in dna manipulation or gene cloning if you are new to my channel and you have not yet subscribed subscribe my channel and press the bell icon so that you can get all the latest updates of my new uploads manipulation of a dna sequence and the construction of chimeric molecules so called genetic engineering provides a means of studying how a specific segment of dna works novel molecular genetic tools allow investigators to query and manipulate genomic sequences as well as to examine both cellular mrna and protein profiles at the molecular level understanding this technology is important for several reasons namely first it offers a rational approach to understanding the molecular basis of a number of diseases for example sickle cell anemia cystic fibrosis etc second human proteins can be produced in abundance for therapy for example insulin growth hormone third proteins for vaccines for example hepatitis b and for diagnostic testings for example aids test can be obtained fourth this technology is used to diagnose existing disease and predict the risk of developing a given disease and fifth gene therapy for sickle cell disease thalassemia adenosine deaminase deficiency and other diseases may be devised now let us understand broad classification of enzymes that are used in gene cloning enzymes used in gene cloning are classified into four categories namely first nucleases second dna polymerases third ligases and fourth end modifying enzymes now let us understand each and every class of enzymes that is its function and its examples first nucleases nucleases are the one which degrade dna molecules by breaking the phosphodiester bonds that link one nucleotide to the next for example restriction endonuclease exonuclease and s1 nuclease second dna polymerases dna polymerases are the one which are enzymes that synthesize new strand complementary to an existing dna or rna template for example dna polymerase 1 clano fragment reverse transcriptase and tac polymerase third ligases ligases are the one which join dna molecules together by synthesizing phosphodiester bonds between nucleotides at the end of two different molecules or the two ends of a single molecule for example dna ligase t4 ligase fourth end modifying enzymes end modifying enzymes are the one which make changes at the end of the dna molecules adding an important dimension to the design of ligation experiments and providing one means of labeling dna molecules with radioactive and other markers for example alkaline phosphatase terminal transferase and polynucleotide kinase etc If you are watching my video for the first time subscribe my channel and press the bell icon so that you can get all the notification of my new uploads directly onto your mobile phone thank you